Good morning, everyone. Thank you so much for clicking on to another DOY Creation 7 video. Welcome back, everyone. Before I get started, uh, everyone, my name is Jeanette, also known as Soraya of DOY Creation. Now, uh, in this video, I'm going to be kind of like all over the place because for the last few days, I have been literally all over the place. So let me make sure that I am recording. I am recording. So bear with me through this video because, yeah, I'm all over the place. And I have been really all over the place in the last couple of days. But I wanted to make sure I popped on today just to let you guys know what's been up with me for the last couple of days. Um, before we get started, you know, I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High, Yah. So as you can see, I'm outside today. I feel like being outside today. Today, it looks like it's going to rain outside, but I was like, I'm still going to go out because I needed to be in nature. Um, I pretty much lost my crojo. I used to hear uh, one virtuous woman on Fresh Off the Hook. She used to always say, you know, you come to a place where you come to a time where like sometimes you just really loses your crojo. I got to that place where I feel like I just lost my crojo. I didn't know what to make. I was just battling like, ah, oh, it's a struggle for me to even pick up the... It was a struggle for me to even pick up the the yarn. So, but I think I'm okay now. I think that this small um, snag has passed by me. I hope it's gone because I got some other things now coming into my head. But I'm telling you guys, I was like, I I don't want to crochet. Mm -mm. I didn't feel like I want to wear nothing. I waist that really nice on this white top. So I think I've been really just focused on my jewelry because it's been doing really, really well. And as you can see, I'm wearing the, the Melanie's today. I only have two of the Melanie's left, which is this one and the gold ones. And the notes ear earrings was running off my board. So, um, so yeah, I'm wearing my notes earrings today. No, these are the Melanie's along with this ring today so i'm gonna start with crochet let's start with crochet then i'll work on to the jewelry because i made this piece right here so when dealing with crochet i picked the the crochet hook back up let me make sure that my volume is all the way up because i do not want anybody to be struggling hearing me okay it's on it's on 10 I picked up the crochet hook and yarn on yesterday and I was glad I did because I was just doing run row and I'll stop skip a day maybe do another row because I just was not inspired to crochet but I'm back and all is well and a lot of you all left comments in the comment section saying that you know, you sorry you had missed live on last Sunday. I did not go live on last Sunday because uh, my internet was down. But it's back up. Everything is good. We will be doing a live video on Sunday. I'll recap that on Friday in case you miss it, okay? So, here is how it's coming along right now. So, here is the colors that I'm pairing up together. That motorcycle is going past. I have the camo and the gold. So I did, I'm doing double crochet, treble crochet, double crochet, treble, double. And then all of these are just double. And then I'll repeat what I did here, here. So now I'm back on the camo color. So, but this is how it's looking yep so I'm on the I'm on the uh, the camouflage color and I'm going to do five rows when I do things like that if I do a certain number of rows it kind of helps me because it gets so redundant that it makes it boring 
So I did five rows, skip a, do a different color five rows, and that's helping me because I'm telling you, it left. So it's going to be long. It's going to be a really, really beautiful dress. I think this dress is going to be anywhere in a small medium. I have a large dress in this pattern that I'm, uh, I'm doing. If you want to see what the large one looks like, just leave it in the comments and I'll show that on the next video so that is my whip you're not seeing much you're really not seeing much but that's my whip starting off with this dress and I think it's gonna be really lovely once I am done I'm using the the M crochet hook, crochet hook in the plastic and this the M is a number 13 yeah so that's what I'm using so that's my whip so with this yarn right here I was um, contemplating or debating should I make a I saw Sutter Place uh, wearing her crochet granny square top I clicked on Zeta NJ3 and yeah NJ3 uh, she was wearing her crochet top so I decided to with this yarn right here because I was between a virus shawl or a crochet top. So I was like, okay, I went the other day and I counted how many virus shawls I have. I have plenty of those. I recently just sold the blue jean one, but I still have a few of them now. So I decided to make this one into the granny square top. What I also decided to do is... Um, do a tutorial on how I make my granny square top so I'm going to go ahead and do one of the panels uh, because it's just simply two panels but I'll show you how I put mines together so be looking out for the tutorial on how to do the granny square top so that is what I decided to do with this yarn right here and I think it's going to be a really beautiful top I have made at least two I think I made so far two granny square tops so this will be my third granny square top and I'm hoping that I have enough yarn to make a nice uh, slouchy hat or maybe my brim hat to go along with it and I'll sell it like a set and I think that's going to be so so pretty so stay tuned to see that top along with the tutorial I definitely going to have that tutorial for you guys I had a couple of people asking me when am I going to do um, my next tutorial but I was thinking what tutorial uh, do I need to do and I came up with this one right here and I'm glad about it because I get a chance to do another tutorial for you all that enjoy watching my tutorials thumbs up um, saying thumbs up please go ahead and click on the thumbs up right now if you are enjoying this video and I realized when I was looking at my analytics and it, would, it shows you on your analytics. Anybody who does YouTube knows about analytics. And what the analytics does, it shows you who's liking your videos, who's disliking your videos, who's commenting on your videos, who's sharing your videos. It shows that in your analytics. And right now, it was showing my analytics was down with the thumbs up. So if you don't mind, take one second and click on the thumbs up so I can turn that red to a green so I can be out of the the red um, because it's important for you to have those type of thumbs up and all the analytics being in green that lets your video go into rotation if you ever clicked on someone video and somebody else video pops up it's because of the number of views or thumbs up they got to get them into that rotation even though you're not subscribed to that person, they uh, video will still show up on your timeline or in that space where you can see what's up next for a video. So make sure you just take a quick second to give this video a thumbs up. So that's my whips and that's my getting ready to be a whip project. I wanted to, I told you guys this video is going to be all over the place. I wanted to show this um, Knit Crate yarn box, the Indigo Glow, outside so you guys can see it a little bit better. And here's the thing, because I got a couple of comments saying that 
my box didn't look like a couple of other people boxes and I believe it's because I am one of the ambassadors for Nick Crate and they just send me whatever they want me to show so I never know if all the uh, boxes is going to be identical or not but I realized for August it's not identical um, so they sent me something a little bit different so they sent me the indigo the dragonfly this brand here the dragonfly pixie okay I guess this is called pixie and this is the dragonfly fiber so that shows up a whole lot better outside and again this is how beautiful the yarn looks really really cool for the fall the skinny ready to come in but what I like about it because it has that hint of purple and that hint of pink just very subtle you can see it it goes in for the um, summer as well so I wanted to show this and also in the box was the bag it was this bag as well so I'm thinking that like I uh, tried to explain before they have different subscriptions um, and I guess this one probably be the next one the premiere that came with the bag this could be the premiere and that's why I got this particular box but like I said all of their yarns are super super cute it's so adorable and it always feels good and looks good so again this is the pixie okay it's the pixie and it's the dragonfly fiber so I'm really really loving this but like I said if you are going to be signing up with knit crate yarn use my coupon code to save um 20 percent off your first subscription and i always send a bonus skein of yarn so you get mines too so you get you kind of like get your money worth and and more so make sure if you have not signed up sign up under my account so that i can send you even more yarn how awesome is that so I just wanted to recap that so everyone could know to say hey I saw DOY Jeanette's um, yarn in her bag and it looks totally different than mine's it's because me being an ambassador I think they just really sends me whatever they want to send me and then they just want me to showcase their yarn now I do have a coupon for five dollar five dollars off if you just want to try out like a skein of their yarn let me know and I can send you over my five dollars off coupon so you can just try it out so if you're not going for the subscription but you do want to see really how good of quality their yarn is I'll make sure that I send you over my five dollar coupon see I'm just trying to spread the good news so that is what's up with knit crate that is what's up with my my yarn situation my whips and different things like that so I wanted to show you this new bracelet if you are following me already on Instagram and Facebook you already seen this but you did not see that I added the carry shells or the curry shells I was like are they the carry shells or the curry shells but I made this bracelet right here using the wire oh here's the glitter part using the wire I made this bracelet it's in purple I got some really um, glass acrylic beads now these are some acrylic beads and like a pretty purple light subtle purple with these purple glitter lips and at the edge I just added some curry shells to it so let me show you how you put it on I really really like this too it's really neat adjust it to your size and there it is with the nice list give me a kiss and then in here I just have the carry the curry shells carry shells or curry shells I think it's the carry shells just like that 
and this is adjustable and again you can get it with the purple ring okay that is super cute so I wanted to show you that also super cute I really like it I only have two of these right here only two exactly in purple purple is one of my favorite colors so a lot of folks has been really um, enjoying oh we don't make a mess please a lot of folks has been really enjoying my you know my wire uh, rings and earrings and so forth so I just wanted you guys to know that for right now let me take off this purple I'm just gonna put it on the whole set I'm about to rock the whole the whole get up how about that working the whole get up I like the wire because you know whatever your wrist it uh, it's a it's adjustable okay I couldn't get that out it's a it's adjustable how cute is that along with along with along with okay I just made that song up okay how cute is that set so you have your purple earrings the purple ring and that can y'all see that real good seeing if I sit back that is super duper cute look at that I had my um, one of my clients she bought these earrings in the green and she bought the ring and she actually wore it for her anniversary I think it was like her I think she was celebrating her 10th year anniversary wedding anniversary and she had this one here and as soon as she wore because she has a nice short haircut she had her shades on and she was really out in the sunlight and so the rings the earrings and the rings had popped re even more she had so many people asking her where did she get it from and they wanted to order it so right now guys these earrings are on sale for only six dollars the rings are on sale right now for six dollars the bracelet is on sale right now for six dollars take advantage of the six dollars because once this um once these go right here the prices will change but as like um what do you call it like uh i forgot the word that i'm looking for but just to start off i wanted to sell this one at a really really nice price so that everyone can take advantage of it because um it will change the prices will change so right now i wanted you to get your hands on some doy wire jewelry why it is on sale so that'd be like six twelve eighteen dollars for that whole set plus four dollars shipping how cute is that it's in that color there so awesome that purple be just like screaming beautiful and again with the red with the red ring i'm going to put on some of the I'm gonna put on a pair of the red the weird white earrings and these one is called strings so if you order these right here they're not on my website once they come up on my website the price will look different because Issy charged me a fee just to have my merchandise if you know about Issy, you already know they charge you to have your merchandise on their website they charge you when you sell the merchandise so they constantly getting their cuts into your profit so that's why I just wanted to sell it at this price right now before I tackle in Issy prices and all the stuff that they do so here are the red pair okay hey guys see that really really pretty Jeez. really really pretty really light it, it it practically feel like you don't even have earrings on but you do and they're popping really loud okay 
they're popping really really loud so those are the red ones so I'm only going to show you just a couple I just wanted to show you a couple of them why again they are on sale for only six dollars the ring six dollars for the earrings and then the braces is another six dollars so take advantage of it because a lot of people is asking me uh, when I'm gonna put it on the website but the prices will look different on the website once you tackle in everything that they're going to be charging you for it okay and then because they are very light product um, it's a flat fee of four dollars to ship it doesn't matter how many pairs that you purchase it still will only be four dollars to ship I have received at least okay that's the end of that I was thirsty I have received at least two to three comments for the people who already received their um, their jewelry that they really like how I put these together and I know you will too so make sure that you jump on the sale why the supplies last okay so that one I have in the purple I have them in the red I have them in the gold let me just show you the gold along with the gold earring okay they call strings and I have them in the green this is how it looks in the green in the green like that okay so I have purchased a lot of wire jewelry in my life and I, I have never paid six dollars for my my jewelry never I'm always paying a nice amount of money for wire jewelry but I want to just have this I almost said it I almost almost said it I almost said the word that I was looking for and I know you guys are saying it for me <sighs> but I can't remember I can't remember but anyway I wanted to um, you know get the word out and everything like that with my wire jewelry and I want you guys to really enjoy it at a really nice price and I think you will so how do you get to order it all you would need to do is email me I'll leave my email in the description box below and then uh, you email me I send you over a secured PayPal invoice once you receive the invoice and pay it I ship it out immediately because PayPal get their money immediately would cause me to get my money immediately and then I could ship your order out like ASAP okay so we'll do it like that and yeah so I think I'm trying to think that was it I told you guys about the tutorial uh, yeah so I'm glad to be back on the camera you guys because again when you don't know when your crow Joe leaves you um, you kind of like be at a standstill like what do I do in the meantime in between time so I'm really super uh, blessed to be doing the the wire jewelry now because once my crow Joe you know want to up and leave I can um, I can go on to making these jewelry right here and keep myself busy and occupied I love to be busy not so busy that it's just I'm all over the place but busy as to being productive I love to make sure that everything I'm doing with my time is counting it has to count so that's where I'm at with it guys that's where I'm at with it with everything just feeling real good this morning um feeling really good this morning I hope you guys whatever time that you are watching this video you too is feeling good and and all that good stuff being productive being positive and being a blessing to someone you know truly being a blessing to someone even if you are um, experiencing whatever you are going through still be a blessing to someone else cuz being a blessing to someone else it actually helps you it'll help you more than it helped them you be like I was trying to help you and I feel help 
and better myself. So that's always a good thing. I was watching Mimi Loves Yarn and she was saying for her site, she want to make sure that everyone is being positive, that's coming on to her website uh, page and everything because she got a lot of stuff that's going on. And Mimi, I do have to check your website out for your groups that you have started or already started and I'm just not getting the news about it but she just was really conveying how important it was or how important it is to you know be positive and spread that spread that positive uh, energy so I really appreciate that so I'll be checking your website out really really soon so yeah guys that is all that I wanted to stop in like I said I'm feeling really good today I feel good to be coming back behind the camera to share what I have on my crochet hook and everything that I'm doing um just wanted to take a second out to to share that with you all I appreciate you all so so very much again make sure if you have not already subscribed it's free click on that subscribe button and please make sure that you do give this video a thumbs up it's important to for the people that you enjoy watching to give them thumbs up because we need it we need it yeah yeah we need it so anyway guys that is all that I wanted to stop in to share with you guys today thank you so much for taking the time out to click on DOY creation 7 video again I will leave everything in my description box below make sure you just click on that to see whatever I also leave the link to if you want to see like the melodies in the notes earrings that I am carrying also I'll leave that because I didn't bring it all outside with me but I'll leave that video in the description bar below so you can see the different types of wire jewelry that I'm selling the rings are pretty much just the same so nothing changes with that I thank you guys again for clicking on to this video until next video uh, please always remember ya yeah, some 68 4 in your King James version always keep your life and your health in check and uh, I'll be checking you all on Friday in the next video. All right. Bye for now.